we were here. Well, I, well, I think yeah, there may have been, we didn't clarify, you know, we didn't state right up front there's a no preaching rule. But uh, we, we really wanted to hear their feedback, even if some of it was a little bit lengthier than we thought it would be. Um, speaking of feedback, I wonder if we have any uh, callers coming in. Ed. Call, are you there? Hello. I'm here. Can you guys hear me? I don't know if you picked up. Yes, indeed. What's your name, caller? My name's Rich. Uh, I'm a Christian. I used to be an atheist. And I had a question for you guys. I was wondering if you could answer it. Go right ahead, Rich. Are you calling from uh, Florida? No, I'm calling from California. Okay. What part of California? Southern California. I'm over All here. Right. You know where Los Angeles is at, where we get free lighting from the police helicopters every Friday night? <laughs> <laughs> That's a great description. So, I used to live in Huntington Beach. Ah, Joe, Joe used to live down there. So, um, so, Rich, you have a question for us. Go right ahead. Yes, and I want to say I love your guys' show because I, um, I believe it's bringing a lot of people to Christianity. I actually play your show to some of my atheist buddies, and we all we agree to disagree agreeably on a lot of things. But here's what I see. I was listening to your show. I do enjoy your show, even though I'm a Christian and I disagree with everything. But um, what I see a problem is why atheists cannot are, are having a problem getting people to believe in the humanist religion of atheism is that there is no proof or evidence that atheism is accurate and correct. And here's the question. Every time I ask an atheist to provide proof and evidence that atheism is accurate and correct, they cannot provide it, except you guys on your show, you have said that proof and evidence is important. So here's what I would like to ask. Here's the question. Go right ahead. We're Without waiting. Without, without uh, answering the question with the question, which atheists always tend to do when I ask do this we? question, well, here's the question. Well, well, Notice I okay. just said it, and he goes, do we? <laughs> so here's the question. Yes, what Ed. proof or evidence can you guys provide that atheism is accurate and correct? And let's see if you can do it without asking a question with the question. And then I'll well, tell sure, you how you a, did That's a fair that's a fair condition, I think. I'll, I I'll, think I'll so. Because there was no proof right. or evidence when I looked for it. That's why I left the humanist religion of atheism. But go ahead. I'll okay. listen. All right. Thank you very much. Well, since I'm going first, uh, the um, atheism accurate and correct. Well, what proof? Atheism no, was accurate proof and correct. Or evidence. Because, what proof no, or certainly. evidence? The evidence. The evidence. First, we have to make sure we understand what atheism is, because you keep talking about the humanist religion of atheism, and I think you're, you, you don't know what you're talking about. You say you were an atheist. You seem to so have a very... So atheism is not humanism? You, you want, not you want humanism? me to answer? Go ahead and let Go me... Go ahead. What proof or evidence? Give me a chance to answer first. We have Please. to make sure we're talking about the same thing, Rich, or otherwise we're only going to be talking past one another. Whatever now, way you, you want to... Listen, whatever way you want to define it, all I'm saying is what proof or evidence do you have that atheism is accurate and correct. Fair it's enough. It's a very then I simple won't, question. I, Try not to him and haunt and avoid the question. Just simply answer it. You should have all kinds of proof and evidence. But well, I've been on a but a minute, and I haven't heard anything. If you want to answer, I will do so. Are you Go ready? Ahead. I'm ready. I'm on the edge of my chair. You'll be okay. the first atheist ever to answer don't, it. Don't fall off. Very well. We won't, we won't touch on your definition. We'll, I'll give you my definition. No, any my definition. definition atheism. Atheism's madness. So who cares what the definition is? It's madness. But go ahead and go for it. I'll listen to see I what I really the... appreciate your listening. So atheism is exactly no more, no less than not having a belief in God. The evidence that, I, that atheism is correct for me is that I, through introspection, know, I know for a fact that I do not have any belief in a God. Therefore, I'm an atheist. Atheism is a description. Where's your Just proof like of that? Where's the proof and evidence? proof that I'm an atheist? You want, Where's your proof and you evidence? You want me to prove that Where's I'm your proof and evidence? That you, you're avoiding the question. See, typical, typical atheist with the spine of spaghetti, what proof or evidence do you have that atheism is accurate and correct? I ask the, a second the, 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 the problem, Rich, is that atheism, we're atheists because of the lack of evidence for a God. So there's well, lack of me, evidence for atheists? So what proof or evidence do you have that atheism is accurate and correct? <laughs> Okay, let, no, please, he's talking enough already. Third, so third time. Talk. Rich, Rich, let, I have answered your question because you keep interrupting me. Where's let the me proof? You didn't, without, you didn't supply any it. proof. You failed miserably let on live try, radio try, 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 to provide any proof or evidence that atheism is accurate and correct. 
No, this does remind me of last night a little bit. Yeah. Let's try this without, me inter without you interrupting. Will you allow me to complete a sentence? As yes, long no. as the next words out of your sweet, lovable atheist mouth is proof and evidence, we want, we, the world, if we're going to risk denying Jesus Christ, and we're going to have to believe uh, in some other type of proof or evidence, you guys are going to have to supply more proof and evidence than Jesus Christ supplied. And what is so good about atheism, where, where's the proof and evidence of atheism that would allow a rational person like me, an ex-atheist, who got two things, I got a brain and I read the Bible. I got a heart and I humbled myself and I confessed I'm a sinner. So I'm Thank not you. hearing any proof or evidence that atheism is accurate. In I know you're not hearing. You're not taking a pause to breathe. <laughs> Go ahead. Here. Now, now that you've answered, just try not to answer. You were saying, you were, Rich, you said define atheism as I no, did. No, I, I did you, not say define atheism. See, you're lying. Play back the audio. I said, what proof or evidence do you have? Don't lie. We have, we have this recorded. How you unfair. You can later and hear what you said. Yeah, play it back. Atheism. I never said define atheism. I said, what proof or evidence do you have that atheism is accurate and correct? And I'm going to be really quiet, oh, and I'm going to listen to the proof and evidence. Go okay. for it. Atheism is lack of belief in a god. When I say that atheism is correct, I mean that I don't have any belief in God. Do you understand that so far? Yes or no only, please. I understand you haven't supplied any proof or evidence. You. Yes, I, I understand you haven't supplied any proof or evidence. Me a, yes, me I understand chance. you haven't supplied proof or evidence. So Good where Lord, is it, though? Yeah, it. <laughs> okay. The There's evidence someone else on the I, line that could at least answer the question. Rich, first of all, the evidence that I don't believe in God is my say-so. I'm saying I don't believe in God because I know that for a fact. The same way if you ask someone, what's your favorite ice cream? How do you know it for a they fact? They say it's vanilla. Where's How, your proof? What's your favorite? Where's, Where's your, your proof, proof that your you favorite ice cream fact. is vanilla? What is your proof that your favorite ice cream is vanilla? Can you prove that? Where's your that? proof you for a fact? For it? Where's Rich, your proof? Your time. Listen, we want proof, proof and evidence. I can give, I can you give have proof failed you miserably. Listen, question. my sweet you level have a mathematical question. This is why I left the madness of atheism. It is based on faith. 100% really faith. I, I, this man doesn't even understand, understand what atheism he, is. He but I think you guys seem like you're pretty upset now. I have, we have shaken the foundations of atheism now that the whole world and everyone on your show knows there is no proof or evidence for atheism. I can say the same thing for Christian. Now we're, going, now we're going to give Frank an opportunity to speak. So, Rich, zip it. It's just a matter I, I, of lack as long of as I, Am I going to have a chance to talk hey, after Frankie hey, Boy here? Just cut him off. We're going to let Frank talk. Oh, uh, running from the debate. No, no, no. You're All not, right, bye. You're well, am I going to have a chance to talk after Frank? You run the show. Just sure. leave, just. You, you, call, you called in to ask us what we think. Just mute him. You can mute no, him. No, I, I asked what to for evidence. Proof and evidence. Stand by. Go ahead, Go ahead Frank. Frank. We, have, we have come to our conclusion that there is no God because of the lack of evidence. You know, extraordinary claims like they got in the Bible require extraordinary explanations. And we haven't seen hardly any explanations at all that aren't just drawn from fables. So we have come to the conclusion that there is no God. And uh, everything that happens to a man is either accomplished by man or is uh, destroyed by man. There is no God there to guide it. Okay, and uh, Joe. Well, I mean, the well that was like a failure. Evidence. That was no proof well, of evidence. That was opinion. But go ahead. Let's go to Joe. Let's see if he's got something better. It's like if Frank says, okay, I have $5. I'm like, okay, yeah, that's fine. But if he says, well, I have now, you know, a whole unicorn in my pocket. A so unicorn! Yeah. For you guys have Santa syndrome. You guys have Santa syndrome. That's what it what? is. So, I mean, how, uh, what proof do you have for, for, Christ, uh, for Christianity? Okay, I'll, I'll, I'm going to go ahead and dip my toes in the water, even though you guys, everyone would agree that you have, I'm going to answer a question, even though you guys will agree that you, would you agree you have not provided proof or evidence that atheism is accurate and correct? You've, you've provided opinion. Well, let Where me can I this. look I, at the proof and evidence that atheism is accurate and correct besides the unicorn? What do you, can I ask you a question, too? What do you atheists got with Santa Claus and unicorns? You love them. Because it's just... And the spaghetti monster. 
Yeah, he might have well, that, I think that thing, well, who do you guys you, think Jesus is? is? Well, I'll ask you a question. I'll, I'll, I'm going to let you guys escape the question because you obviously cannot provide proof or evidence on live radio. Oh, well, what, well, who do you guys think Jesus Christ is? Do you have... Oh. Oh, well, it depends on which Jesus Christ you're talking exactly. about. There's the Jesus Christ of the literary Jesus Christ of the canonical Gospels, the Jesus Christ of the uh, Gospels that didn't so make it into the canon. So who do you think he is? Basically, well, it's basically whatever you imagine. It's who do you it's think he is? There are, about, there are about as many different views of Jesus Christ as there are people. Look at the pictures people draw and the statues people make. Jesus is white. Jesus is black. Jesus is Jewish. Jesus is Aryan. Jesus is I can tell you, I can prove to you guys... Your, I can prove to you God oh, exists. Are you ready to listen? Whatever you make up in your mind. And the point is, you're asking for proof or evidence of atheism. You no, I'm not. I'm saying that it's accurate or correct. He seems angry. He's, I'm, I'm not angry at all. I love you guys. Well, I love you guys. I just say you're an atheist. Do you guys love yeah. me? Let's, well, hold on one moment. Let's go Wait, back. Wait, you guys love you me? You did ask for I love you guys. Okay. All right, hold on a second. Hold on, Rich. We, okay, this is, this is our show. We're going to get an edge in. We're going to get a word in edgewise. The question that this caller asked was, what proof or evidence do you have that atheism is accurate? Of course, the moment we start touching on that, he immediately interrupts, just repeating himself over and over again like some maniac. Talks about the madness he was in. I don't think he's left it yet. Now, what we need to do, if you're going to give proof or evidence or anything, I'm trained in mathematics. I know what proof is. Proof is something that you demonstrate rigorously. Now, that's great. If someone has a mathematical definition of God, I'm willing to hear it. But let's stick with evidence. The evidence for atheism is the simple fact that people don't believe in a God. Atheism is not a claim that God does not exist. I think that's the basic error that this caller is having. He thinks that atheism is the claim that God doesn't exist. Rich, you're wrong. That's not what atheism is. Atheism is a description of being without God, being without a belief in God. We don't believe in gods. What's there to prove about that? There's nothing that needs to be proven. Now, if you want to say, well, when we're considering the question, is there a God, can you prove there's not one? No, but who cares? Hey, folks. Um, I just watched a video that was sent to me by the Axel Snacks. And this guy actually is an atheist. Now, I want to let you know, uh, he admits that I totally pwned the atheist show. Listen to this. And then click the pop-up here. And so this is an honest atheist admitting it. Listen. Axel Snacks here, and this is a reply to a Shock of God video called Christians Run Circle. Oh, Christian Runs Circles Around Four Atheist Radio Hosts Actual Live Call. Now, this, uh, this video is basically an advertisement for another video or uh, something else. I've, I've already seen it before about he calls in the, some atheist radio station and you know, poses a question, how is atheism accurate and correct? and basically destroys them which is really funny because they're they're numb skulls on that radio okay. show <laughs> you guys um he's a real atheist uh but i have to admit at least he's honest it takes a lot of guts to admit that i did destroy those atheists on that show <laughs> i'm sorry i had to laugh if you want to hear the video where he's talking about it, there's some profanity, so I didn't play the whole thing. But he does admit that I destroyed the atheists on the show. It's called Why Do Atheists Preach Atheism? So I want to thank uh, Axel Snacks uh, for making an honest video admitting that, yes, I did destroy those atheists on the show, and boy, did I destroy them. But it's pretty easy uh, when you're dealing with atheism because atheism is a bunch of crap. So here you have it, guys, an atheist admitting that I destroyed the atheist on the show. <laughs> Even he's laughing about it. Oh, if you want to know what show he's talking about, it's absolutely hilarious where I totally take control and dominate all four atheists on the show and get them to admit the only proof and evidence they have that atheism is accurate and correct is their say-so. It is kind of funny. Click this pop-up right here that appears on the video and you can listen to it. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to keep uh, getting these videos. I'll keep the atheist... Uh, humor uh, coming for you guys um, make sure you go to my channel 
and subscribe. I also have a video of Richard Dawkins rides a motorcycle for the first time. Check that out. It's absolutely hilarious. So thanks to that atheist who agrees that I did go ahead and destroy the other atheist. He's being honest. Everyone knows it. Everyone on YouTube knows it. God bless you, man. I mean that sincerely.